First at six tonight, a seven year old continues to fight for his life after being shot at a South Memphis home. Family members identify him as legend Johnson and say he was just an innocent bystander. Thanks for joining us for the News at 6. I'm Greg Hurst. Hi, I'm Stephanie Skurlock. As WREG's Jordan James reports, loved ones say this is not the first time they've been caught in the crossfire. As bullet hole after bullet hole lined the walls of this South Memphis home. I just thank God. I just thank God that God was here with us. A family is counting its blessings despite several rounds of gunshots being unloaded Wednesday night during a drive by that left seven year old legend Johnson with a gunshot wound to his buttocks. His aunt acts not to be identified. He's like, Auntie, they shot me. He was like, They shot me, Auntie, they shot me. He was like, but I'm okay. Legend was inside of a bedroom with other children when gunfire erupted along Doris Avenue. His aunt tells WREG that the home has been shot up multiple times and believes they're being targeted by a gang because of a disagreement on social media. All this, this violence needs to stop. It's like, it's, it's getting too bad. It needs to stop. People is dying every day. Last year, 31 children were victims of homicides in Memphis. Labonner Children's Hospital also treated a record of 156 children for gunshot wounds. It's a trend that has been increasing since 2018 and has community leaders concerned. Put your guns down, let's save these babies. We need to start praying more and stop fighting against each other. Every time we fight against each other, we lose. So far this year, Labonner Children's Hospital has treated 16 children for gunshot wounds. As legend continues to recover there, his family hopes this shooting serves as a wake up call for the community. If you guys are going through anything, any type of violence, any type of arguments, you know, back and forth, disagreements, anything on Facebook, leave that alone. People are dying over this It's just, it's just ridiculous. Reporting in South Memphis, Jordan James, WREG, News Channel 3. Pulling for that little guy and legend is expected to make a full recovery. MPD is still searching though for the suspect who was seen driving off in a white four door infinity. If you have any information, call Crime Stoppers at 528 Cash.